Welcome back, everybody. I'm your host, Kelly Sparks. Uh, today, I've got a double whammy for you. Um, I'm going to do a subscriber request over the Sexton, and I'm going to go ahead and pour this one up. This is a single malt, triple distilled Irish whiskey. I've had it for a little bit. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pour these up. I'm going to go ahead and do one. I've got a tiny little ice marble, if you can see it in there. For a, uh, a lighter whiskey, if you like yours on ice, I recommend using one of those instead of a larger cube. You'll have less you have uh, less water to water it down. So I'm going to let those sit for a second. The other part of this one is uh, I got I, I told I think I told you guys about a package that I was getting from Kent England. Well, I got it in today, and this is from my subscriber and uh, podcast follower, Mark Zara. Oh, yeah. The request was from subscriber uh, Jebby Doe. Jebby Doe. He says, greetings from Limerick, Ireland. Love all the review with videos. Just wondering, have you tried the Sexton Irish whiskey yet and possibly do a review of it? If you can, it's my new tipple at the, at the moment. So, Lucky for him, I literally have this bottle sitting right here. So, I'm getting to it first. Apologize to everybody else who's asked for a review, but hey, I already had it. So, I'm going to let those sit for a minute, let them open up, let that ice do some work. But I'm going to go ahead and open this up, and we'll have a look-see and see what Mark, Mark Zara, Zara, I apologize if I'm screwing up your name, Sent me. Looks like it's all in one piece, Mark. Got my trusty old timer. Wing. I'm not sure if anything is in there. There's something, there's something, something definitely in there. Let's, uh, See if we can get this apart. I asked him, I hope it wasn't a dildo. But that would be my luck. We got something here. Oh. Not very good bubble wrap. I'll have to work on that one. We're going to go ahead and open this one up first. I got two things. He didn't say he was going to send me two things. Good on you, Mark. Mark's the man. Mark is also my third Patreon member. So hats off to you, sir. I appreciate your help. And uh, we'll hopefully one day get to meet you and we'll have a nice drink. I don't know what's inside it, and I don't want to just rip off into it like it's Christmas Day. Wow, this is a, oh, <laughs> it's a stand. You did a hell of a job wrapping this up, Mark. This is just a stand, so... Nice little plastic stand. All right, so I'm guessing it's going to go just like that. Then uh, I'm probably not going to cut this one open. We'll start at this end and uh, just uh, just kind of cut the tape up. Always cut away from me, folks. Safety you first. Let's 
<laughs> it's going to be like one of those gifts where you take it out and it's a smaller version of it. What are those called? I think it's a Russian name or something. It's two packages. Hilarious. Getting somewhere. Oops, I'm like this like sealed tight. <laughs> and it's in another box. Oh. Well, you can't. You can't knock the guy for uh, protecting. Uh oh, oh, it's wood. We've got wood. Can't knock the guy for protecting his craftsmanship. So he's got a couple little cards here. They might be stickers. No, it's a thick little card. No, is this a sticker mark? I don't think it's a sticker. It might be a sticker. Anyway, so it's flyer. Firefly Art uh, UK. You can find them on Instagram. His name's Mark Zara. It's pretty cool little stuff. All right. Let's go ahead and rip into it. Got a little uh, hanging set there. I'll hold on to that. The suspense is killing me. My ice is almost melting. Goodness. you guys see it first so oh that's too cool that's pretty neat that's freaking badass mark check that out it says on the back to kelly and the bearded idiots team from your fans at fireflyart.co.uk that's freaking cool. Man, the detail on this thing is ridiculous. That's freaking awesome. Look, he's got a little red beard up here in the corner. Freaking sweet, Mark. We'll worry about that later well that's a pretty freaking awesome gift if I do say so myself I'm gonna have to hang that up in the house or on the door so everybody can see it I'll put it on the door and put like firefly art send me a sticker mark <laughs> put it above it freaking cool man looks just like me all right well thanks Mark I appreciate it uh, I don't want to make this video any longer than it has to be, so I'm going to go ahead and get into the whiskey. So, uh, Sexton is a, um, I'm going to read off some notes that I got. Sexton is a new and unexpected modern day Irish single malt. So, this one just came out not too long ago. It's crafted using 100% Irish malted barley and triple distilled and copper pot stills resulting in smooth, light, and fruit floor. floor Fruit forward spirit. Very, very fruity on the nose. I get like apples, maybe a little bit of honey, some cinnamon, maybe. All in all, man, it's a, it's a nice little drink, and I think it's relatively reasonably priced. I want to say around uh, around here parts, around these here parts is about twenty eight dollars. 
if I remember correctly. Yeah, that's totally enjoyable. I mean, it's you can definitely it has that that single uh, that copper pot steel mouthfeel and texture to it, whereas most blended uh, blended Irish whiskeys are just smooth and uh, there's not too much going on. All right, so I'm not gonna bother adding water to it because it's only I think it's bottled at 40 percent. Yeah, it's 40 percent. So water is just a drop of water is probably just going to mute all the flavors. But I'd like drinking some drinks chilled. I wish there was a little ice left in here, but Mark's wrapping was way too thorough. <laughs> so it's freaking cool, man. Yeah, that's badass. So the ice really didn't do anything to it. It's just still got all the flavor it's just chilled now you can't smell it crowd crowd pleaser uh, actually I like it uh, I like it both ways uh, I think it's enjoyable either way neat or on ice or I mean chilled with a little bit of water I mean, it's, uh, it's a tasty little drink. I think my roommate's watching something, so y'all are going to get some background chatter. Uh, for the price point, um, man, I would I would give it a, a 7. It's a, it's a good daily drinker. It's, uh, I mean, it's obviously, it's not the greatest thing out there, but... For, for the average person, for the average working man who d doesn't have thousands of dollars or hundreds of dollars to spend on whiskey and you want something that's going to taste good and you're going to get a good quality drink every time if you're into Irish whiskey, this is a good substitute for uh, Jameson because it's relatively priced the same and uh, it's a single malt. So Jameson, I'm pretty sure, is blended. So it's got that up on it. It's going to have a little more flavor to it, a little more bite. So, yeah. So I, I got the tasting notes pulled up, and I didn't read them beforehand, I promise. So it says, nose at first, honeyed malt, nuts, and dark chocolate, followed by marzipan, allspice, and fruits. Clean and mellow taste is clean and mellow honey malt, and then ta then ta then uh, I can't talk, and then the taste complexity reveals itself: rich dried spices, nuts, and sweet oils, a pleasant gentle wood, with honey sweetness fading slowly. Hmm, that's good. That's good stuff. I like it. Uh, it probably wouldn't be my daily drinker just because I'm a here lately, I've been getting into more heavier bourbons, so it doesn't have quite the punch that I like. But all in all, JB Doe, I think this is a good drink, and I would not be dissatisfied to drink it again. So, I think that's all I got. I want to say thanks again to Mark. I might just have this sitting next to me until I can mount it to the door from now on. This will be my co-host. I'm Redbeard, and this is Skull Redbeard. Thanks, Marks. Uh, thanks, Jibby Doe, for asking for the single malt. I'm glad I had it in stock. Um, but I think that's all I got, folks. Uh, like always, drink some whiskey, share with your friends and family. Have a good day and be safe. Thank you.